Discipleship 101, this one's been rocking here for a little while. It's our attempt here at our church to kind of give some, uh, some practical steps for all of us to take with personal disciple making. Uh, sometimes, especially if you've never been discipled before, which is pretty common, uh, to take a step of, uh, of discipling someone or being in a discipling relationship can be daunting. And so we're, we're, we're giving this kind of a, a first steps as a church. So uh, you, you get the free book over here if you're willing to go through it with someone else. And there's nine chapters. Go through it nine weeks, ask the questions, it's all in there. And uh, so uh, I'm going to go ahead and invite Mike uh, and Matthias up here, Mike Dunn, Matthias Bieber. Uh, they've been uh, doing this for a little while and have them give uh, just a little bit of their experience, it is on, of what Discipleship 101 has been like. So yeah. All right. Well, uh, yeah, I appreciate the opportunity to come up and speak a little bit and get, share our experiences. Um, I guess I'd start out by saying how thankful I am to be a part of a church like this that really puts an emphasis on the gospel, because that's, that's the big thing, right? That's, that's the reason that we all come to church. That's, that's the whole deal. So um, when Ben was talking about doing this discipleship, you know, very early on, I made the decision, yeah, that's for me. I want to I wanna be a part of that. I want to do that. But that's the easy part, right? And then you have to, the second part, okay, who am I gonna do this with? That, that's the part that can be a little bit intimidating. So, you know, I did the, well, I'll give it a week or two and see if anybody comes and asks me to do it. <laughs> now, of course, that didn't happen. So then I had to make the decision, okay, I'm, I, I wanna ask somebody. And um, to be honest with you, God had already kind of put it on my heart. I should go and ask Matthias. So can't argue with that, right? So I go and ask Matthias and we decided we were gonna do it. and. Um, for our routine, we decided we would try to meet once a week, um, you know, like after work. And kind of going into it, we realized, you know, there could be some difficulties with that. We were expecting that. And unfortunately, I mean, it has been difficult. I've had to cancel a lot of times just based on my schedule. But the times that we have um, met, um, you know, we go through this Discipleship 101 book and um, basically some of the takeaways that I've had so far, um, between the content of the book, my favorite part has been just our conversations that we've had. That's where we've had the opportunity to really deep dive into the gospel and what that means. Um, so yeah, that's the, that's, the, that's the big thing. And once you really start looking into the gospel and, and, and you know, dissecting it, you, you realize just how holy God is and how there's nothing I can do to deserve what this is. You know, it's a gift, right? Not only is it a gift, but it's the gift, and it's something that we shouldn't be holding on to ourselves. We need to get out there and be sharing that with others. So, you know, I just want to encourage you guys to um, take that step, try to get, find somebody to go into discipleship with, whether that's, a, you know, a brother or sister that you can go alongside and dissect into what it is, or just finding somebody to take on your wing and um, go for it. Yeah, thanks, Mike. When Mike asked me to join, I had just no um, thought in my mind that that was something I was going to do. But since Mike invited me, I thought, yeah, that sounds amazing. Let's do that. But I was just ignoring it. Every time it was presented, I would just think, well, that's, that's for somebody else. And then the times that we've gotten together have been very rich. And in, in the devotional, the, the instruction book is very good for directing your conversation and getting things started, and then it's not, it doesn't take long for the two of you or the group to just think about ways to apply what you've just talked about or even just begin talking about your life in general and how you need prayer. And please pray for me in this regard. And please, and this is really, this is a big struggle in my life right now. And then Mike is listening to what I need to talk about and I'm listening to Mike. It's been very rich, and it's not just the book, but that's an excellent resource that we're, we've been using. Yeah, awesome. I, I could resonate with uh, the first time I went, I, I knew I was supposed to ask like my first person ever that I was gonna like get, get in a discipling relationship with. I, I had nerves akin to like asking someone out on a date. So I, that, that's made me a little awkward if you and a buddy are, you know, but you get it. I, it, it, it. That's sometimes the first big hurdle, but then once you start locking in, it's pretty, it's pretty rich, so. Thank you for sharing that, um, and thanks for uh, giving us a little glimpse of what it's like.